guys, welcome back to Cooking with Leah J, where we love to cook almost as much as we love to eat. Today, I'm gonna to be preparing for you guys a whole red snapper. It's very quick, very easy, very delicious. So we're just gonna jump right into the video. All right guys, so here's everything you're going to need to make your whole fried red snapper. I have our beautiful red snapper here, some thyme, some rosemary. We have some Creole kick or some Cajun seasoning. Um, garlic powder, total seasoning, onion powder, garlic salt, citrus blend, black pepper. We have peanut oil for frying. Peanut oil is the best for frying because it has a high heat temperature. And then we also have some lemon for garnish and for eating afterwards, and then our flour. So it's gonna go ahead and start preparing this fish. All right guys, so the first thing that we need to do is we need to go ahead and trim the fins this top layer right here because it's very spiky and very, very prickly and you don't want to hurt yourself. So we're just going to trim along the top of this. We're going to trim along the tail here and trim along the bottom pieces here. All right, so once your fish has all the bones, top of the bones cut off, all the prickly pieces cut, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to take our knife and we're just going to slice down just like this. do just like this we're gonna do the same thing on the other side all right guys so now here I have about a teaspoon of each of the seasonings that I showed you I forgot to show you that I also put salt in here but I only put about a half a teaspoon because the other seasonings already have salt in it and we don't want it to be too salty so now all we're gonna do is we're just gonna take this and we're just gonna sprinkle it on the fish and make sure we get it in between those cuts that we made into the fish Alright, and here our whole seasoned fish is. We got it in between every single cut here. Now the only thing we have to do next is I'm just going to sprinkle a little bit of flour on the outside and that's just going to help bring out the excess moisture that's in the fish and just make sure the skin and the fish gets nice and crispy when we fry it. So all I'm going to do is just take this flour as I'm just going to sprinkle it on here and then dust off the excess. thing we have to do is I'm just going to open up the fish here and we're just going to stick in the thyme on the inside of here and we're going to stick our rosemary and then we can even open up the mouth here and let it stick out the front. And she'll be in just like that. Now we're gonna head on over to our stove top to fry it. All right, so my oil is all heated up and ready to go. Now it's time to fry our fish. Just gonna lay. And we're just going to fry it until it gets nice and golden brown on each side. Alright guys, here is our whole fried red snapper. I fried it for about hmm, maybe six to eight minutes on each side. I was just waiting for to make sure the inside is nice and cooked and that the skin was nice and crispy on the outside. Let's go ahead and plate it up. And here we go guys, here is our finished product. Quick, easy, simple, but also delicious. 
let me know if you guys go ahead and try this out I would love to see in the comments how it worked out for you guys and go ahead and put any recommendations down in the comments of things that you would like for me to cook next I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you on the next one bye